Okay, we're going to start this lesson by saying, Call the law Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shah, by Hashem Rakakadash. Double honors to the elect of GMS preaching his word in truth and sincerity. And anyone teaching the likewise doctrine, this is King Jesse back with another Bible lesson. But before we go into this lesson, Yahweh is who you ignorantly call God. Yahweh Shah is going to be who you ignorantly call Jesus Christ. The Rakakadash is going to be the Holy Spirit, and Bahashem means in the name. So when you call on your power, you call on the name of Yahweh, Ba'ashem Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashem Rakakadash. No longer call on the fake-ass name of Jesus Christ. That shit gonna get you killed. Letter J was invented in 1524. So there's no way our Lord and Savior your name could be Jesus Christ. It's Yahweh Shah in the Paleo-Hebrew. And he's the so-called black man from the tribe of Judah. Uh, you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native American Indians. You are the Israelites. Uh, you so-called white people, the European race, starting with the elite banking families, you are the Edomites. Pursuant to Job 9 and 24, the earth is given into the hands of the wicked. And we're going to get into this lesson, the true name of God, first down from the apostles of GMS. And like I said in the introduction, Yahweh Shah is his name in Paleo-Hebrew. And these, uh, and uh, hopefully elect of GMS is going to actually, the apostles of GMS is going to actually break it down. And, uh, and give you uh, his real name. So we're just going to go ahead and play the video. Not too much more talking to be done. But look at um, the time stat. It says 1422. So you take that 1 and that 4, and you add 2 plus 2, and that's 4. 144. Four. Call the law, Yahweh Bashim Yahushah. video, um, I'm going to bring out a couple precepts to show you how important the name of the Lord is, because a lot of these plantation Christianity churches, uh, you know, they teach you God and Jesus Christ, and uh, first off, God is a title, it's not a name, and Jesus Christ, the letter J was invented in 1524, our Lord and Savior was 2,000 years ago, so what did they call him back then, because they damn sure wouldn't call him Jesus, right? And so um, I'm going to go ahead and let the prophets, uh, the hopefully elective uh, Israel, go ahead and break down the name of the Lord. I'm going to bring some precepts out at the end, quick and, vi um, quick and easy video, and hopefully it's that fun.
part two was coming up next.